Everyone's doing good so far, Killer Kim. Alright, guess we're gonna go give Clementine her hat. Oh. I'm gonna go cl give Clem her hat and try to figure out a good place to stop and hang out and chill and all this other stuff. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. <laughs> Whoa! Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. <laughs> Did you lick it? I don't know. <laughs> Did you lick it? Uh, I don't know. Did you lick it? I, 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 I don't know. I always check all the stalls before getting into anything because you never know what is going to happen and you never know what's hiding in those things it's dangerous empty All right, let's head back over to Clem and give her her hat. Here, Clementine. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Uh... I'd like to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Yeah. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. Let's talk to... Hey there, Andy. Yep. How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Thanks. Yep. Why is it that, Have like, every time we mention no, something, they get really, really nervous? Mm, it smells funny in here. Well, like manure. What's manure? Duty. <laughs> Kids. <laughs> What's manure? Duty. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Oh. Sounds like it's getting ready to rain. In the game, anyway. Oh my! How does a woman like yourself run this whole place? 
Oh, make it Chewbacca! Woot donated ten dollars to the hubba. Is all I can do right now. It is appreciated. If you all could tweet out the stream, try to get more people up in here, and try to get, uh, try to get more people in. Maybe some more people would like to donate to hubba. That would be pretty awesome. Hmm. Let's take these wire cutters. You never know when the wire cutters will come in handy. Never know. Always make sure you look around. Let's go talk to Danny. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. How do you run this place with just one cow? Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry and a few <laughs> Oh, we got a new follower. Thank you. you guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. I just realized that we need to have uh, the Twitch alerts on the screen. Whoops. Alright. Alright. It should be fixed to where Twitch alerts will pop up now. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Not much, I guess. Exactly. I don't trust this guy. For supper, then. It'll be a good one. I don't like this Danny fellow. He's creepy. We'll, uh, we'll finish talking later. You been getting along with Larry? <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart, ain't he? Uh, don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge, honey. This world is bringing out the worst in people. But if you really look, you'll catch a glimpse of humanity every now and then. We ran into some trouble out there. I was just glad you two weren't hurt. Those bandits just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. I think all them folks out the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? Means you can't trust them. Any of them. How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He could definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. Uh, not to be rude, ma'am. How come you're out here instead of, you know, <laughs> oh, you want to know why I'm not slaving away in the kitchen? Is that it? Uh, no, no, I didn't mean for it to sound like that. Oh, it's okay, darling. Got it slow cooking in the oven. Should be ready before too long. I think uh, I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. Alright, I'm gonna go watch some video, guys, because I'm, like, behind. Alright. So... I'll come back here in a little bit, okay? Alright, see you, Woot. Okay. Thank you. So, now that Danny has noticed our quote unquote suspicions of the thing, and not sure how I'm going to feel about this, 
But we we're, we're going to go talk to Mr. Larry. Let's go talk to Larry. As bad as I hate to. So Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? <sighs> hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? We found a tent and some boxes. Nothing really useful. Seriously? No food? Jesus. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Do you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. I know what you mean. These backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm gonna go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty uh... protective of their privacy. Hey, I'm gonna go check things out. Just okay, don't get too nosy. These Nothing like to talk to her about. So, I don't know. Having a crop like that on hand must be great. We're gonna need to learn how to maintain it if we end up staying here. I get... I'm very suspicious. Talk to Kasha. Not Clam. I guess I can't talk to Kasha. Of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. Hmm. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal on those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... You know... <laughs> urban? Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. <laughs> just because he's black, he Kenny well, thought that he would be able to screws, pick a lock. Breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly. That's funny. Inside and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. 
Can I help you boys find something? Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hmm. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Distract him. I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Any thoughts on how to distract Andy? I don't know, man. Just look for something outside of the barn. We need him out of here. Hmm. Look for something outside of the barn. I don't know what to do. I'm not sure either. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Let's use the gate and see if we can't figure something out. Wait, let's go over here. We 